For our movement break, we're gonna be down on the ground working on a lot of lower body and then we'll move our way up to upper body. And we've got six moves and we're gonna go through them two times through. So we're gonna start with just some basic knee pulls. So lie back flat, extend your left leg, pull in your right, relax your head and neck and just lay and keep pulling. Don't just hold your knee, really pull so you can get that stretch right here towards the hip groin area of our quads. You want to rock side to side instead of just holding, you totally can. Otherwise, just focus nice, subtle breaths. We've got 10 seconds left on this side. Three, two, one, switch. Left leg comes in. Make sure you're resting that right foot, leg on the ground, don't hover it. Might feel a little tighter in one leg over the other, that's okay. Just keep pulling. Nice calming breaths through the nose. You can exhale through the nose or through the mouth. Last three, two, one. We're going back to our right leg now, but for our figure four. So go ahead and pull that right leg in so the bottom of your foot is off to the left, the right knee is off to the right, and then bring that left knee up to that right ankle. You can hold here, you can sit yourself up and pull, or you can have one hand pulling and one hand pushing your knee. You completely decide, up to you. Again, either holding without, Focusing on that left hamstring, or one behind the leg and one pushing that knee. We've got about 10 seconds left and then we'll switch sides. Three, two, one, switch. Left ankle to right knee, same thing. Three different options of how you wanna hold. that push-pull momentum going so you can get that nice stretch. Stretching out that IT band, that really small ligament tendon running along our leg. Last three, two, one. Bring both knees into the chest and lie over on your side. We're going to do a chest opener in our 90-90. So pull those knees up in tight to the chest. Bottom arm on the ground, top arm on that hand, and we're just going to bring it over. Bring that right shoulder or whatever side you started with to the ground and then bring the hand back to hand. Just keep opening, closing, keeping that lower body where it is, working on our upper body now. Have your eyes follow your hands, those fingertips all the way out and then bring them back. Last three, two, one. Flip it over to the other side. Same thing, pull those knees up tight to the chest, relax your head and neck, open and close. Last three, two, one, flip it over onto all fours. We're gonna do our quadruped opposites. So my right arm goes, my left leg goes, just like so, and then alternate and switch. We're here for 30 seconds. Nice straight line, nice stability, balance. Last three, two, one. Moving into thread the needle child's pose. So you've got toes and knees apart or feet and knees apart either way. But sit back into that child's pose and then take the left through the right. Rest your head on the ground if you can get there, otherwise you're gonna be holding. But reach with your left, reaching forward with your right, sitting back on those heels and just hold.
and switch. Right under the left now. Reach forward with that left, reach out to the left side with your right arm, sit back on those heels. Nice breaths, we're not holding our breath. Three, two, one. Now we're gonna do some wrist mobility while in child's pose. So we're gonna start with our fingers forward and then we're gonna turn them out to the side and then I want you to try to bring them back towards us. So just regular child's pose, that first one. So fingertips forward, push those palms really hard into the ground and then bring yourself forward and push back. Forward. Push back. Last one, bring yourself forward and push back. When we bring ourselves forward, turn those fingertips off to the side. Same thing, push yourself back, forward, back, forward, and back. Good, now bring those hands directly normal where they were and now turn them inward. So they're not all the way facing you, they're kind of angled, same thing. So our elbows are gonna be slightly bent. Try to keep those hands flat on the ground, pushing yourself back. Last one. Good, all right, flip it back over to your back. We're back to our knee pulls. Same exercise as we just did. A little less time now that we're a little bit more warm. Last three, two, one, switch. We'll do our figure forward next. So we'll go back to our other leg. That push pull mechanism with our knee and our ankles. and bring that other leg up. Options, I'm gonna switch up mine this time. Last time I did a push and a pull, this time I'm gonna just focus on pulling in my hamstring. Still pushing my ankle against that knee so I can push my knee out. Nice subtle breaths. Even if you're tight, might be in a little pain, don't hold your breath. And switch. Pushing and pulling against each other, almost there. Last five. Three, two, one. Good, roll over to your side. We've got our 90-90 chest opener. Pull those stack knees up towards the chest. Head on the ground, open and close. Last one, three, two, one, flip it over. And begin. Remember, allow that shoulder to go to the ground. Follow those fingertips. Last four, three, two, one, good. Quadruped opposites. Right arm goes, that means your left leg goes. Three, two, one, begin. Squeeze that glute. Ten seconds left. We've got our child's pose, thread the needle. Four, three, two, one. Again, toes together, knees apart, or both apart. Back in that child's pose, left through the right. Relax your head on the ground. Reach and sit back on those heels. And switch. 
such and bring it to regular. All right, starting with fingertips forward, lean back, push the ground away, bring it back, shoulders over palms. Good, turn the fingertips out to the sides and same thing. Our arms are still straight on this one. It's our last one, those elbows are gonna be bent. Here we go, one more. Good, turn them the other way now, angle them in towards you, and here we go, three of them. Bent elbows, keeping those palms down against the ground the entire time, push the ground away. Last one. Three, two, one. Awesome job, thanks for joining me.